when it comes to interviewing people for positions at a firm, are there any specific questions that you recommend lawyers ask? And if, if, if not specific, what do you recommend that lawyers do when, when interviewing people? Absolutely. So, uh, and all the employment attorneys who are listening will appreciate this. So before you go ahead and create your interview questions, please check with your employment law attorney. Uh, there are rules by state that uh, basically regulate the kinds of questions that you cannot ask. And so those rules change all the time. I'm going to throw out some questions that I think are legal in the state of California. But again, check with your employment law attorney before you use uh, any of these questions. Um, so one of the one of the questions that I like to ask is actually it's actually a style of interviewing. It's called behavioral interviewing, where you ask them to to tell a story about a time when they did something. So tell me about a time when you. Um, actually went to a networking organization and built some referral relationships and how that worked out for you, right? Uh, or tell me about a time when you had a really, really challenging client. What did you do to give them a great result and to make them satisfied? And so by asking those open-ended questions, so tell me about a time, um, those kinds of things, it forces them to provide more than a yes, no answer. They now have to elaborate and they have to tell a story. And uh, in the course of telling the story, it may lead to other questions. It's also harder to make up an answer when you're telling a long story. It's far easier to do it with uh, with a yes or a no type thing. So asking those behavioral style questions uh, is good. The other thing I'd encourage you to do is uh, give some thought beforehand about what the values are for your firm. And the values as I define them are the unspoken promises that you make to uh, other members of your firm to your clients and to your colleagues. And the reason that's so important is you want other people joining the firm that share the same values. Once you understand what those values are, you can then ask questions that uh, will elicit responses that will tell you, is this person a good fit with our organization or not? For example, if one of your values is fun, you might wanna ask, what does a fun workplace look like to you? And see what they say. Um, and the third thing is, uh, do not be afraid to use tests. Um, I can't tell you how often this happened. One of the reasons why I wrote the book was I would be working with a client. I'd say, go hire somebody. And they would. And then this attorney comes in and they don't do the work. And then all of a sudden they realize, oh my gosh, this attorney basically exaggerated their skill set. They don't have the skills. They don't have the quality. And it's just a complete miss. And so what we found is that implementing tests for candidates is really, really helpful. It helps reduce the likelihood that someone's gonna join with a skill set that's a mismatch for the role. 